Well, my outright favorite, a little bit like you, I was saying between a couple of names, I do think Rory is going to go on to win the FedEx Cup. I'm saying that right now. Um, and I think that with Rory, he's been so close. He's been like, what, um, top 10 in every one of the majors, top eight actually in all four of the majors. And we saw how close he came, you know, that dramatic finish at the Masters to finish runner up. And then at the Open Championship as well, the absolute heartbreak that we saw from McElroy. And even though he's had a good season, it's not a good season by his standards because he wants to win one of the big ones. And the last big one remaining is the FedEx Cup. So he's at number six in the standings right now and i'm tipping him to go all the way and win it but this week <laughs> i'm going with sam burns at 34 to 1. um with with so many strong players as you say in the field you know all kind of like coming back after the absence of the last few weeks i'm surprised that burns is at 35 to 1. I, I didn't think he would be as high as that. So I'm taking him right away. He lost in the playoff last year in the WGC here at TBC Southwind. And I mean, he shot two, uh, what was that, 66, 64, um, had one kind of higher scoring day, but he's three wins, eight top tens this season. He's 10th in putting, 13th in approach. I, I looked back at the three WGCs that have been held here and the kind of stats for the winners and iron play, greens and reg, approach, scrambling, all really big. And Burns to me kind of fits that mold. So I'm going with him at 35 to one this week. Sam Burns is my outright favorite. Well, I only let you have Sam Burns because you're pregnant <laughs> and I let you pick first off camera. But I love Sam Burns. He's long enough. He's a long enough player and he's a straight enough player to hit three wood off this course a lot. I saw him do it last year and, and, he's, and he's playing so well, you know, one at Colonial. This is a pretty easy golf course for these guys that we mentioned already at the top, Diane, because, you know, you can move it off the tee. You've seen all the big hitters hit it. You don't get in too much trouble. It's all about getting the ball next to the hole and actually converting all these birdies. But Sam Burns, he's on a bender. Um, you know, it's it's a tough – It's it would we've talked about weeks that are tough to pick. This is it right here because of the talent that's playing and they're all squished together on a course that they're going to take 20 under to win on. And he's third in the FedEx Cup standings right now. So as we were saying, Scheffler just with an um, insane amount of points to sit at number one. But I mean, Sam Burns, 2,275 points. Um, so again, a lot of volatility at the top. And I would say that he's in better form than Scheffler is right now. So watch this space. 